All right, so we are now live on audio. We were live on video there for a second while we set up this interview. I have the great pleasure of uh, sitting back and having a few words with uh, Reno Lino, uh, Capricorn. He just told me 17 times and I forgot already. Capricorn America, right? Capricorn America. So Reno has taken over Capricorn America. I actually have a bunch of shots of the, the trailer. The trailer is absolutely awesome. Um, we're going to take a couple of in-depth shots of the car, both the A-scale, 10-scale. I understand there's an electric car as well. Um, so, you know, I, I'll, I'll ask you some questions a little bit later on about what you got coming. But uh, take a few minutes um, for me and, and, and help the world, uh, introduce the world to the new website and some of the new things that you're doing. Yes, well, thank you first for, for the opportunity. And, uh, yes, uh, we just uh, took the distribution for Capricorn Italy. The name of the company is Capricorn America. Our website is uh, capamericarc.com. Um, we are adding products every day. Uh, Capricorn has so many products, it's hard to do it uh, in uh, such a short time, but we will be adding products every day. And uh, the newer products that we have are basically the Black Edition, which is the, um, basically is the lab CO2 with uh, all the upgrades that are that have been coming through uh, the evolution of the car, but it's still the same platform. Minor changes, but uh, it's, it's what DJ is running on, even on his red edition, um, and they just made it black, and we're, we're working on that, and uh, the engines is actually something very big, too. Uh, we're very happy with the performance of the engines this week. So tell me about the engines, because I didn't realize that, uh, that you know, you were, that there were new, that, first of all, that there were new engines, and then that, that we were, you know, in the midst of that change. Yes, the engines uh, are called XRD. They're not Capricorn engines anymore. Um, but uh, there are engines that, uh, that I've been testing in Italy and uh, we just brought for this race. Um, and we have some racers already, already using them. Very happy with the performance. Uh, I actually have one myself and I'm very impressed with uh, how they work. Sweet. So, you know, some talk about Capricorn, but let's not forget about, you know, Cosmic, right? Which is where you start. Now, I personally run Cosmic, so I'm a, a little, well, a lot biased, let's be honest. A lot biased. Uh, you know, a lot of people up north run Cosmic as well. And uh, so it kept my engine clean. Um, I've been running it with Picos, and I've had zero issues with it. Um, it's, it's great fuel, very consistent, stores well, which is something that's important because I store it in my garage. And uh, the containers that uh, you ship it in, it stores very, very well. So uh, tell me what's going on with the new blend that you brought to the race this week. Yes, uh, that new blend is a blend that DJ has been testing for, I would say, about a year. Um, it's uh, very similar to what we have. It just uh, cleans a little better. We believe it's a better formula than what we had before. Protects the engine very well. Uh, and it's the blend that... Um, DJ's been using lately, and I've been using myself to test. And, you know, before releasing it, we made sure it, it's something that we really like. And it was uh, very big for us to come and bring that new blend to this race. So, you know, again, folks, out, out they, they don't may or may not have met you at some of these races. You travel a lot uh, worldwide. I've seen pictures of you with a giant airplane in South Africa. I've seen you in Peru. There's a big race in Peru that a lot of the races from here go to. Um, you know, I've seen you in Dominican Republic. I've seen you all over the place at all of these races. So, you know, you do more than just RC cars. You also do planes, helicopters. I've seen you with your quadcopter. Um, so, you know, you, you, you know fuel, you know engines for multiple disciplines of RC. Yes. Uh, I started in the hobby doing RC planes, which I started when I was around 10 years old. I used to compete a lot on. F3A, which is a uh, acrobat uh, category of planes, but yeah, we during those years I learned a lot about uh, engines. Uh, back in South America, Peru, where I'm from, it was hard to get fuel, so we used to mix it ourselves. Get you know castor oil, nitro, and uh, methanol, and mix it ourselves. And from that, I learned a lot. Now, uh, of course, came a long way from that doing it, you know with little bottles yeah uh probably a lot of people don't know this but the machine that we use for mix uh cosmic fuel is a machine that we design ourselves from a scratch well that's outstanding and that's also good to know so there's some custom engineering and what goes on so it helps you set yourself apart a little bit uh from the industry 
Um, you know, there are some folks that have come from Europe and actually have run your fuel and have talked about bringing it back to Europe because, you know, it's better than some of the brands that uh, they have read, readily available there. Yeah, it's, we're very pleased that um, the guys that came from other countries like the fuel. Not only that, but they like it in different brands. It's very important for us. Because, you know, the, all the manufacturers have different standards on how they do things. And for us to see that every brand likes the fuel is it's very good. That's outstanding. So, any secrets that you have to share with us this weekend? Anything upcoming? Anything hot? Yes. Uh, secrets. There are always secrets. But uh, one thing that we're going to be doing uh, is uh, promoting the new electric car that um, that um, is acting. And uh, we're going to be very well prepared for that. Um, we're building a strong team. And uh, we hope we can do great. That's awesome. Well, I'm, you know what? We uh, there's a newsletter. Well, oh, first I got to shout out. There's a guy actually behind this, uh, behind this uh, backdrop here, Pumira White, and he, he's going to be up here in a, just about six or seven minutes. So I'm going to let him go get prepared. Um, but he's helping us out. So shout outs to to Poo for helping us out on the uh, backdrop here. But the 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 electric worlds. It's it's. I'm glad you brought that up. So we have a newsletter up in the Northeast RC Crack, and that one of uh, one of the guys that races at Horsham, um, and other electric tracks does. So. You know, I'd be curious to to see if you can get some uh, some time with him, and uh, you know, maybe get some pictures of the the lab EO one, I believe it's called EO two EO two. Okay, yeah. The lab EO two um, is the new car. Um, we're testing it right now here in the U.S., and uh, I'm sure it's we're gonna have it ready for the world. Reno, it's always a pleasure. It's always a pleasure. Uh, Reno Lino Cosmic and Capricorn USA. Uh, I'll post um, his website on the video at the bottom so you can go and click and uh, check out his fuel and parts. Reno, thank you so much.